treated or moving or treated as the electrode. What do we mean by treated as the electrode? The normal earth electrode is surrounded by the soil. Now by removing the soil, we can add some other material which has a resistivity much lesser than the soil. What happens because of this? The overall resistance of that earth electrode will be much less. Now by using a pipe electrode on a 200 ohms and ohm meter soil, we get 55 ohms. So if I want to achieve 1 ohm, I have to use 55 electrodes. But if I don't have that much area, one best option is to remove the soil and add some other material of lower resistivity, let's say 2 ohm meter. By adding this, I may get a resistance of 1 electrode of 10 ohms or 15 ohms. Then maybe 10 electrodes may be sufficient. Practically, if you see, the area around the electrode, a 1 meter area, influences the earth resistance. As per IEEE 142, which is based on experiments, one feet around the electrode influences 68% of the earth resistance. So this one feet area, if you change the material, you can change the complete resistance of that earth electrode. What all can we add? One is we can add charcoal with salt. The second, you can add bentonite. This bentonite is a volcanic uh, soil. It has lot of minerals in it. So that's why it has a low resistivity. Or you can add some salts like sodium chloride, calcium chloride, magnesium sulfate, copper sulfate. You can mix them and add. Or there are some chemicals sold in the market, you can add them. For some of them, like bentonite, you have to add water. Whichever salt it is, water needs to be added because conduction takes place due to combination of water and salt. So it is electrolytic conduction. If you add even around 5% salt, we will reduce the resistance effectively. See, one there is one disadvantage of adding these salts or these chemicals. That is, we will contaminate the soil. So you have to go through local regulation. Some local regulation don't allow addition of chemical around the electrode. So please go through that. And one more thing, as the earth resistivity reduces the corrosion of the electrode increases. So when you add some material, corrosion increases. So you have to be aware about that. But when the resistivity is very high, there is no option. You have to go for treated and electrodes. Now I have already explained about the res resistance of electrode in case of low resistivity material. You can use this formula which I will be explaining.